This video demonstrates how to use the micrometer screw gauge. The micrometer screw gauge is more precise than the vernier calipers and has a smaller measurement range than the calipers. This micrometer can measure up to 25mm. Place the object to be measured in between the two faces of the screw gauge. The thimble is the rotating part. Twist this until the two faces are almost holding the object in place. Then twist the ratchet, which is the very end part of the screw gauge, to hold the object in place. This avoids putting excessive pressure on the object but keeps a consistent pressure on it. In this case, the reading on the main scale is just past the 10mm mark. On the rotating scale, it's between 0.2 and 0.21mm. It is closer to 0.21mm, so the overall measurement is 10.21mm. The uncertainty in each reading is 0.005mm, and because there are two readings, as the zero is a reading, the total uncertainty is 0.01mm, so the final reading is 10.21 plus or minus 0.01mm. Here is another example of reading the screw gauge. On the main scale, the tick marks on the bottom are 1mm each, and the ticks on the top are 0.5mm each. On the main scale, the reading is between 12 and 12.5mm. 12 On the rotating scale, it's between 0.25 and 0.26mm, but it's closest to 0.25mm, so the overall reading is 12.25 plus or minus 0.01mm.